Hola YouTube, what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero and welcome to episode 31 of our relatively new Pokemon Ultra Moon Expanded Let's Play. We're doing the most in-depth Let's Play of this game. In the last episode, which was on Saturday, um, we did an hour of power where we did a whole bunch of things in Coney Coney City and as well as taking on Olivia's Grand Trial. If you missed that and want to check it out, click the i-card up at the top of the screen. In today's episode, we've done a whole lot since then, and we're heading to Hano Grand Resort. So if you're excited for more Pokemon Ultra Moon, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new, and share the video out if you wind up enjoying. Now, let's go ahead and start with a team recap. Like I said, I have been doing a whole lot since we last played, uh, but the team remains the same. First up, we have Arukenimon, our pet, the level 27 Araquanid, with Leech Life, Bubble Beam, Infestation, and Bite. Then we have Jet, our favorite, the level 28 Umbreon with Assurance, Bite, Quick Attack, and Sand Attack. Um, holding the Amulet Coin. Wait. Our Kenimon's not holding anything. I don't know why. But anyway. Then we have Buttons, our starter, the level 27 Dartrix with Razor Leaf, Pluck, Tackle, and Ominous Wind holding the Scope Lens. Then we have Negative Vibes, our Pokeball Eating level 27 Snorlax with Body Slam. Body Slam, Brick Break, Defense Curl, Amnesia holding the Leftovers. Then we have Frisco, our mascot, um, level 28 Oracorio with Air Cutter, Peck Pound, Teeter Dance holding the Sharp Beak. And lastly, we have Lindsay, our special level 28 uh, Lycan Rock Dusk uh, with Rock Tomb, Bite, Thunder Fang, and Thrash holding the Normalium Z. Wait, I'm going to change that. I'm going to change that right now because we got something new for him in the last episode. Now, like I said, I have been doing a whole lot in this game. Like, I mean a whole lot. <clears throat> Let's give that here. Yes. Okay. Um, so, when I say I've been doing a whole lot, what I mean is I went back and caught everything. Everything. Okay, almost everything. I'm missing two things. I only need to catch two things, but as you can see here, I have three and a half boxes of Pokemon that I've caught. I've caught literally everything that you can in the game so far, except Gumi and Cast Form. Both of those need weather. Uh... Anyway, Rotom's talking to me and distracting me. Let's go ahead and head off. I'm ready to play. I went out of town for a couple days and haven't gotten to play. And I just feel like playing. So you know what? We're just going to freaking play. Alright, so this is a new area. Live my life in search of pleasure. I wonder if I'd find something new to enjoy if I went through the island challenge once again. Oh, you mean like playing through this game again? Wait, there's got to be a sticker down here. Oh, found it. 44 stickers. I feel like I've missed a bunch of stickers. The wedding is about to start. I want you to celebrate with us. Oh. Oh, that's too bad. Teleport is flying. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Hold on. Okay, let's celebrate with the boy. Thank you, it starts now. Here they come, the bride and the groom. Okay. Here, okay, I'm not singing. I'm not singing that song. What is happening? Why is this happening? Game Freak, we get it. So beautiful, right, honey? Think of me. What is happening? What? Why is... What is happening? Always be nice to each other. Oh, well, you may kiss the bride. What just happened? Here's your wedding favor, or whatever you call it. Thanks for celebrating with us. Was a rose incense with what we what worth what we just saw? Also, why'd they all walk away? We get carried around in Pelipper's, Pelipper's beak too. Alola is so interesting because it has all these different architectural styles thanks to many people coming here from all over. Can I talk to one person that's important? Just one. Just a single per Aren't you? You're the famous Chooster! Oh my goodness. 
Why did I think it was anything different? You've become a household name with the massive success of your latest film, Schuster. Though the rumors that you were here in Alola were true after all. How are you spending your time off? What brought you here to Alola now? I must ask that you respect Master Schuster's privacy and let him vacation in peace. He will not be taking interviews at this time. What? But everyone's just dying to know more about the famous Schuster's private life. You've got a spill. Please, miss. We've already asked once nicely. I'm stepping in. This is this is stupid. You want interview too? This is my scoop. I'm not letting you have it. I'm blowing this woman away. She is annoying. No, if someone says no interview, then you walk away. Comes out mill tank. Uh, what are you gonna use? Roll out level 26. All right. Also, apparently I didn't heal since my last but Oh my goodness. Are we really doing this? <sighs> I just want to play the game. I don't want to... Okay, we're good. We're good. I've just been looking forward to playing again for like... Three days, four days, something like that. This is not what I was hoping for. This is not what I was hoping for. Oh my gosh, that did so much damage. That did not do so much damage. <clears throat> so we are we are all pretty much maxed out in um, in our happiness. So, the crits and the dodges should be plentiful. Hopefully they're not annoying though. Well, I lost, so can I still have that scoop? Ah, but the freedom of the press! Thank you for helping us out of that rather situ sticky situation. Oh, it seems Master Trooster is most appreciative of your assistance. Chew! Oh. What, are you sure? Sir, if, if you insist. This is from Master Schuster, for you. Oh! The Candy MZ. Please, use it wisely. <clears throat> Thank you. Thank you, I'm... You know, I haven't complained too much about this game, but I'm tired of Pikachu. I'm honestly tired of Pikachu. I'm sorry. I'm tired of Rotom as well. Like, the Bellop is the first member of the hotel staff that a guest encounters when they arrive. First impressions are very important, just as important as the first movies you have your book, blah, 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 blah. Blah! Alola is how we say hello. Alola is how we say farewell. May the love of the sun and moon shine upon you. I'm one of the bellhops. Ring the bell and I'll hop to serve you. The touch of the Alola breeze feels like being wrapped in kindness. Wait and feel it blow over you. Alola is the land where I was born. Alola is the home I was born into. Welcome and please feel at home as well. Okay, Faba, please make this better. So you come at last. Ah, but forgive me, I have yet to introduce myself. You may call me Fama. I told you before and I would show you some place to stand you, right? Well, that wondrous place is Aether and Paradise. Let me tell you about Aether and Paradise. Just as the name suggests, Aether and Paradise is a veritable paradise for Pokemon that floats afar out in the sea surrounding Alola. It is an artificial island made entirely by human technology for the protecting of Pokemon. Of course, I'm an adult who keeps his promises, so I will prove to you that all I've told you is the absolute truth with a tour of Aether Paradise. You will come, won't you? Nope. Hmm, yes. Well, children are often too frivolous and aimless to properly think through. Ahem, <clears throat> I mean, they value their freedom, so... But the answer that I want to hear for you is a resounding yes! Now let's hear it! Nope, I gotta finish exploring this place. As terrible as this place has been so far. Would you like to show me how much your Pokemon have grown since joining your team? Which Pokemon will you show me then? 
Let's go with our starter. All right, Buttons, how much have you grown? Looks like Dartridge was only level 5 when you first met. Now it's level 27. Been real decent to it. Thanks. My solemn duty to teach a move to mythical Pokemon. No, I don't have any mythical Pokemon. Now give me something. Oh god, I'm so scared. Would you look at those biceps? They're bulging with strength. They're practically big enough to burst. Can you even imagine how far you'd be able to drive a golf ball with those muscles with muscles like those? Huh. The Machamp seems uncomfortable. Should you stop them? You'll probably get dragged into a battle. Stop them! Oh, excuse you! What do you think you're doing? We hired this big fella to be our caddy. And we're in the middle of something important right now, so how about you get off my grill? Yeah, get lost, would you? I just want to play the game! That's all I want to do. I just want to play the game. I just want to play the game. What's that? Oracoria and Oracoria. That's not annoying at all. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to start with... How did I get healed? What happened? Fight. Over here. And assurance over here. Whatever. Let's just go for it. Jet avoided the attack. Our Kenimon can't avoid attacks. Jet avoided again. Jet was the last one. I don't even know if Jet is fully done with the whole... Uh, what are you going to call it? Um, the whole refresh. <clears throat> uh, not starting off in a great way. Hano Grand Resort. Alright, I'm switching out. I don't want to die. Let's switch to a level 27. Let's just switch to negative vibes. Negative vibes can take it. And we're gonna go we're gonna go after this thing, so let's set it up. So we're gonna finish exploring all of Hano Grand Resort, and I kinda wanna also go out to the side part and explore all of that during this episode. And then the next episode we'll head to wherever it is that we're going. Uh, Aether. We'll head to Aether next. But it's been weird not being able to play because now people are posting videos like the people that I was watching are posting videos like that are ahead of me. And I know they're ahead of me. They've had the game a little longer than I am, but now they're posting those videos. So I've got to I've got to get back where I was. Got to get some videos stocked up. Oh, so it's like that. The mystery is too deep. You know what? I'm so tired of people being sassy and people being mad. What is up with you? I know, right? Just totally killed the mood. Let's just go. Yes, please leave forever. Don't come back. What was that, huh? You trying to be a hero or something? You going do what? What you going to do that for, huh? I'm not a Pokemon. I'm a bored and bred human being. Duh. This is just a costume. Like seriously, dude, are you just here to ruin my day? Going and blowing all the hard work that I put into disguising myself as a Machamp caddy? I was going to make some real bank off this job. And then you had to come along and try to rescue me? Man, I want to cry right now. But I know you were just trying to help. I can't get mad at what you did. So here, just take this. Now get lost and don't you talk to me again. What happened? Hi there, you look like a traveling trainer. Alola is so nice and warm. It's totally the best, isn't it? I'm a traveling songwriter, you see? Being here with my cute bird Pokemon in a resort like this is just what I needed to relax and come up with some new tunes. <sighs> I really don't want to go home. Just kidding, haha, <laughs> I was totally messing with you. Oh, I know, since you stopped by to talk to me at all, why don't you don't why don't you battle me and my bird Pokemon before you go? Thanks, and let's do this. No need to hold back while facing me. <clears throat> nice trum beak you have there. Didn't you have a Murkrow? Did I miss something? 
Did I miss something? Lindsay, come out here, please. You know what? No, Lycanroc, yeah, you're avoiding that. You're avoiding that. You're avoiding that. Hit the rock tomb. Die. Go. Shoo. 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 Do you want me to sulk? Yes. Yes, I do. You've wasted so much of my time. Maybe I was a bit hasty challenging you like that. I don't think you're an old, any old trainer, don't you think? Hey, if you'd like, why don't you have me... Battled me with a flying type. And you gave me a... Uh, gave me the TM for metronome. That's it, Crawler. Keep punching, punching, punching. Oh no, come on, Crawler. Still too shy to fight in front of strangers, huh? Hello, the thing you have there, is that could that be a Z power ring? Please, you must have a battle with me. Oh my Crabala to feel the power and energy in a Z move. Once it sees your Pokemon at full power, I bet Crabala will feel ready for a brawl and finally overcome its shyness and anxiety. There, there. Now, are you ready? Second. You know, <clears throat> I was looking forward to playing again a lot, but it's like. And I haven't complained about this game before, but these quests, these little side quests, are so stupid. Ugh, okay. <clears throat> We're good. We're good here. We're good here. This might turn into a long episode. Alright, here we go. Alright, buttons. Buttons, you're like the weakest member of our team. Lee no, I used the wrong move. What I meant to do was this. Alright, here we go. Let's hit it. Huh? Well, wait, this way and then that way. I've forgotten all of these Z-move dances. Okay, here we go. Supersonic Sky Strike. That's just gonna come down on you. I wonder if that would have O-Code. Probably not. TBH. TBH, it probably wouldn't have not. Kabbalah is so full of power, it's practically shining. I disagree. Completely. Oh, that was wonderful. You were most... You were almost shining with all the power. Don't you think so too, Kabbalah? Oh my, your fighting pose looks wonderful. Oh, of course. You always hated losing, didn't you, Kabbalah? You see another Pokemon show level power. Oh, I know, I know, I know. It's from Kabbalah. Five full heals. Cool. Oh. Bye. Would you look at this thing? It totally looks like an Oddish, right? Whether it's your golf swing or your battle skills, it's hard to improve without a bit of guidance. I've been learning so much about my game from Miss Kahili. She really is a golf pro. Kahili here? Like, that would actually be useful. Somebody would be useful. I'm the hotel detective for this establishment. There hasn't been a single incident that I haven't been able to solve. Because there hasn't been a single incident even reported, in fact. Hey, that's good enough for me. Better that than having some... Are you the... Your Pokemon will listen to what others think around it, blah 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 blah. I don't care anything about what you have to say. <laughs> the owner of the Hanogram Resort is a great golf fan. 
And his daughter, Miss Kahili, is a world class golfer too and a real strong trainer. Whatever type of Pokemon, whatever type of Pokemon that your Pokemon are weak to, you should have the other Pokemon on your team that you're still giving me a tutorial. What I'm is what I'm coming to understand. Faba, I should have let you take me away. I should have let you take me away, Faba. Faba. Okay, sorry. I'm all right. I'm all right. No, stop. All right. So here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we do. We're gonna heal. We're gonna go through the rest of that. Well, should we do it in the next episode? No, we'll do it here. I can't imagine that it'll take us more than 10 minutes. Maybe it will, actually. You know, Rotom. I was into the. You know what? Never mind. Let me stop. Let me just stop talking. Let me just stop. Let me just stop. No, oh, shut up. Yeah, go ahead, be sad. It's like every other Let's Play on YouTube. Where nobody even knows that you can press Rotom down there. There is not a Pokemon Center at the Hano Grand Resort. No, no, shut up, oh my... Why? Why does... Why do they insist on... Just interrupting the game? I don't, I don't get it. Cool. Thanks. Nice. Awesome. Shut up. Alright. Here we are on Hano Beach. Ah, here's a warning to you. The only people you find in the water are Pokemon trainers. Be careful out there. The only reason I can luxuriate like this is thanks to the work I do here on this beach. If you're interested in part-time work, go chuck in Sapukumuku. Oh, you ain't getting away from me, totem sticker. Ah, you ain't getting away from me. You thought you were getting away from me. You ain't getting away from me. That's Mr. Pukumuku, guy. Candy guest. I would not like to do anything. I am waving goodbye. Here, why don't you take this? Please don't say anything else. Don't say another word. What, would you rather have this have soda pop by our store? Okay, thank you. Thank you for saying one thing. And then just Wait, is that is that gonna Okay. That spot, that little surf spot looked weird. It looked like it didn't look like it used to. It didn't look like it usually does. That was weird. Alright, we're good. You know You know work. Work frustrating. Come home. All I want to do is play the game. The game's being stupid. I don't want to have to put Oricorio in front like I always do when I just want to escape. All I want to do is run away from a tentacruel. From a tentacruel. Tentacruel isn't even good. Tentacruel literally isn't even good. All right, let's fight. Let's fight. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Next episode will be much better. He's... And then you have a Pelipper. What did I do? What did I do to deserve this? I don't think I can do anything. I don't think I can do anything to it. Yeah, I, I really can't do anything to it. I'll just switch in here and body slam something. I don't know. Ah! Body slam! Yeah! Woo! Yay! Pelipers! My favorite Pokemon on the planet. No. Not the case. Not the case. Landed a crit. So Snorlax... Oh my gosh. Snorlax avoided a move, landed a crit, and paralyzed. And is now also level 28. 
Let's learn rest. I'll keep all moves. Thank you. Snore. I will keep all moves. Thank you. Buttons is now level 28. Wants to learn synthesis. Um, I'd rather heal than I'd rather just use a healing item than. Thank you for your contribution. Bye. I like how Rotom says, here's some advice you didn't ask for. It's like, no, how about you just shut up? Like, is that is that an option? <clears throat> Where's the off button? Does Rotom have an off button? I'll click it. <clears throat> I'll click it. I'll click the off button. Don't you think I won't click the off button, Rotom? Swimmer Lawrence, two Pokemon. One of them's a Basculin. Okay. Okay. That's at least a water type and not a flying type. So now I can do one of these things. Razor Leaf. Use Takedown. That did a lot of damage. That did a lot more damage. Okay. Did they, like, up the refresh rates? Because... If I crit here... I don't know. This is... My intention was for it... Th was that it was like the last game. Because um, I know that, you know, it was... It decided a lot of battles. I get that. But it was never every single turn. So if this crits... Okay, I mean, I guess. I mean, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. Please don't be paralyzed. I don't even want to care. Like, wild, man. It's like the game knows that I haven't played in several days, and it's just trying to... It's, just, it's intentionally being a jerk. Intentionally being a jerk. Cool. Yep, yeah, thanks. Bye. I wish I could see my map right now. Okay, all right, we'll be good, we'll be good. Note to self, maybe I need a little more of a break in between work and recording. Maybe I need a little more of a break between work, work and recording. What are you gonna do, Confuse Ray? I'm actually surprised that it didn't use Confuse Ray. Uh, are you? It's more like star dead. Or like, uh. That's a whole lot of, of turns being decided by, uh, does Rotom talk more? I'm, I'm just thinking about this. Does Rotom talk? Oh my gosh. I really don't care. I really don't care, Rotom. Hey, shut up. All I was trying to do was see how much water I had left to go. But instead, I was being told about the QR reader that I just already know about. And you have a Gyarados. And that's really threatening. And I really only have one Pokemon that can handle that. So I'm going to switch into that one Pokemon. And I'm just hoping that you don't use a water type. 
I remember this guy from the original Sun and Moon. Okay, cool. Here we go. Thunderfang! That Gyarados popped. I literally popped the Gyarados. All right. What else does Rotom have to say? All right, hold on. I'm going to see if Rotom goes away. All right, cool. Now, after the next battle, let's see if Rotom pops up. Let's see if he honestly pops up after every single battle. And Game Freak, if you're watching, this is not necessary. It is not enjoyable. It is annoying. And it's invasive. It's actually like getting in the way of me playing this game. Like... I, I liked Rotom. I thought I thought you know what Ro what Rotom was there to do was pretty cool. Now I'm getting hit with counters. I'm going for it. I don't even care. I'm going for it. I don't even care. If he if he counters me, he's probably gonna live. Probably, this is probably going to do less than Razor Leaf. Why? I don't know. Because Razor Leaf was super effective, and because Dartrix sucks. Yep! Confirmed everything I just said. Phew. What, Innards Out going to kill me now? Okay, good. I'm just super triggered today. And I've been like this all day. It's not even just this. Hey look, Rotom is telling me something again. I, I just... Alright, well I'm gonna fly back here. We're going to go ahead and call that an episode. Today's episode was really frustrating, and I just need to, I mean, obviously we're ready to go on to Aether Paradise, which we will do in the next episode, uh, but man, I'm just... Let's hope the rest of today's recording session does not go like this, because I really would rather not be annoyed. I've been looking forward to playing this game for the last several days, and this episode was just not... No, how about... If you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you for the next episode of Pokemon Ultra Moon, the Rotom Dex, blah, blah, blah. Until then, have a blessed day.